welcome back. Um, so welcome to, what am I calling this video? Stuff I wasted my money on Amazon edition. So whether or not I actually wasted my money is kind of up for debate. Not in the sense that I actually bought useful things, which I tried to do a little bit, but in the sense that I bought these using Amazon gift cards, so I'm not using my money. Um, and of course the day after I bought all this stuff, I realized all the things that I meant to buy. So like, I haven't had a clock in my room for probably like, I don't know, two or three years, because my old one broke and I just haven't replaced it yet. So I was like, oh, maybe I'll get a clock and finally have a, something on that spot of the wall where I still have the command strip hanging for a clock. Uh, but I forgot about that. And I also, like, I collect the Nancy Drew books because I love them. And I have this, like, three-in-one pack and I only have two of the books. And I was like, oh, I should get the third book so I can get rid of that three-in-one and you're tilting, I'm sorry, and have, like more space on my bookshelves forgot about that too so here we are most of my stuff has arrived because I usually buy th things that are prime but uh and not all of it is here yet so I'll probably just put like screenshots of what I what else I got here but the first things I got are actually somewhat useful um I got this guitar strap I like the pattern and I like the blue and I thought it would complement one of the guitars I have quite nicely so I got it and it also came with like a couple of guitar picks but those are just like plain kind of boring you know so you don't really need to see those and I also got this sun guitar strap because I don't know I like the sun pattern I thought it was cute and I also thought it would complement the other guitar I have I don't know why, but I decided to look at earrings, and also this box is so unnecessary, like this packaging, I guess. There they are. No, this stupid thing's in the way. Um, but that's what they look like. I don't know why. I was just really, like, drawn to them for some reason. Um, I really like the flower and, like, this, not necessarily holographic thing, but, like, iridescent I guess is the word you would go with for there something triggered my dog he barked but yeah I just I thought they were cute and I think they were on sale too so I was like I'm a sucker for sales that's just how my mom raised me thanks mom I'm also a massive sucker for washi tape in case you couldn't tell in my last haul I bought that like drawer thing to store all of my washi tapes. So this time around, I bought more washi tapes to go in that storage thing. Um, but hey, in the end it's worth it because I got it on Amazon so I was able to get 30, right, 30? Around 30 for like 10 bucks or something, which is a good deal, especially when you consider the price on like those indie Instagram shops. And also, lasts for a pretty long time because I don't think I finished a single roll yet and I've been bullet journaling for this is my third year now and what was my other point oh yeah it makes me happy so clearly that makes it worth it right right okay they came in three of these little things so this one has little golden bunnies on it they could focus better it's like little gold cat outlines some donuts Nip sticks, little succulents and containers. I like this rainbow polka dot one. Like, I just think it's very pretty. This leaf one, gold stuff. I wish they were all oriented in one direction. These little bikes, golden mushrooms. And this is, it's almost My Little Pony-esque. Like, do you see that? Like, I think it's just, it's either just a rainbow pegasus or maybe it has a tiny horn for like a unicorn pegasus. Um, either way, I think it's pretty cute. <laughs> then the second one has like the days of the week on it in gold, which I'm not the biggest fan of washies with the days of the week or like words on them because I'm like, I don't care. I just want like that cute pop of color like I I don't know how I'll use this except maybe occasionally to be like 
here's my little heading for every day, but I don't really do that. Maybe I will now. This one just has little gold crosses, it's a little geometric design, paper airplanes and clouds, another geometric design, bananas! That just has cute little random designs on it. Little bunch of balloons, rainbows, oh and the clouds have little like smiley faces. I wish it was focusing better. And then this one is just like a flowery design with some gold. And this last one has rainbow stars. Very cute. These like birds all on like, I guess a telephone wire. Do do do. And cacti and succulents and what are they called? Pots, I guess. Coffees little hearts some like citrus I guess that one will look better like that so it's just like little pink polka dots interspersed with like random little white cats or what the white ones are I guess oh I think this is like some balloons like floating up to the sky oh I actually have one very similar to this why well, it's making it look very like pinky but it's more purpley in real life and then owls. I love owls. They're probably my favorite bird. Like, at our marching band assessments, I was like performing upwards because that's what we were supposed to do. And I looked at one of like the light posts and I just saw an owl chilling out there. And I was like, that's a good sign. And we got superior, which is the highest rating you can get. Uh, so thank you, Magic Owl, for blessing us that day. I love you. I don't know if it was real, but I'm gonna say it was real because that makes it cooler. So I don't know about y'all, but I'm a sucker for like Disney movies. My three favorites growing up were Sleeping Beauty, Cinderella, and The Little Mermaid. And by my three favorites, I mean those were basically the only ones I'd ever watch. Um, at least when I was like five years old, at least. So I got this Disney princess like postcard box thing. It's just like a hundred collectible postcards from all the different movies and it has like concept art which I think is really cool as well as like screen caps from the movies so like I don't want to take them out and shuffle them because I don't want to worry about like bending them or getting them out of order but you can like kind of see what I'm talking about along the sides and I just thought it was really cool like it was so cool to like look through all the concept art and be like like these are the ideas they had and you can think about like how they actually put it like into the movie and I just think that's really cool I love looking at concept art for Disney movies I remember when I was at downtown Disney and in the art of Disney store they had like an original production drawing of um, Sleeping Beauty and I wanted it so bad but it was two thousand dollars so this is like my replacement for that like I've just been on like a Disney kick kind of aren't we all always but I don't know I'm just kind of interested in like the actual like animation and like the concept art and stuff so I don't know I might look for a book about it at some point this last thing is really random um I got a tarot set because I figured why not I didn't go with the Rider weight one because I think that I mean it's basic it's like the kind of default tarot deck uh, this is the Line Strider deck, so it did come with a little how-to book, which I really need because I've never done this before, obviously. Uh, and I figured that even if tarot cards like aren't going to tell me my past, present, and future, it would be fun to freak people out with them, you know? Just like at a party, like shuffling the cards, being like, alright, where's the death card? I'm gonna pull that up for this person. Um... And I kind of went with this deck because I thought it was very aesthetically pleasing. Like, I don't know. I just... I like this, like, art style. And I saw another one I really liked, but it was a pre-order. It wasn't coming out until March. But I might end up getting that one later on, as long as I actually like and use these. Because something I thought that was really cool about it was that it had, like, three or four different lover cards to show, like different gender combinations in a relationship is the best way I can think to put it and I just thought that was like 
really cool and also that art style I also really liked um, but I didn't want to wait until March for my tarot cards to come oh and that's what the, like the back looks like it's just like a little watercolor design it looks like one of those ink blots that you always see like psychologists or whatever movie hold up and be like what do you see and like a normal person is like a butterfly and then the psychopath is like a murder scene but yeah I'm kind of excited for these because I just think it will be fun to mess around with them so that's the kind of person I am so yeah that's what I have so far that's what's come in the mail so the other things I'm waiting on are a set of four washi tapes that just kind of have like pastel sort of geometric -y designs on them if i can like manage to put a screenshot up here i will so that you can actually see what i'm talking about and then i got a patch with like from arches national park well not necessarily from it i don't think the national park service made it but it just has like one of the arches at night and i thought it was really cool and i've been there um so i thought it would be cool to continue on like the line down my like patch jacket sleeve where so far it's pretty much just Hawaii volcanoes and I was like oh it would be cool to like get a circular one from like national parks I've been to and just like do a line down the sleeve so that's my intentions for that one um I got a galentine's gift from one of my friends and I also got one of the galentine's gifts in the mail but I'm not showing that because I don't want to spoil it for her. What else did I get? I think that might have been all. I don't know why, but it feels like I got something else that I'm forgetting about. Probably because this is probably one of the most things I've ever gotten from Amazon all at once. Because um, I usually don't get that. I usually don't get $150 in gift cards. Uh, but I did this time around, and I'm not complaining. Because Amazon... I love them. So I guess this is the end of the video now because it just is. But I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, go ahead and like the video. Feel free to comment down below. Um, and subscribe if you want more. I usually post every Sunday. Um, sometimes I get crazy with it, but you, I've mostly been able to stick to Sundays. Um, and this year I'm going to try and like pop in with little bonus videos, probably on Thursdays. Because at some point I would like to start uploading twice a week, but I'm not quite ready for it yet. Just because I'm still a high school student, <laughs> like I need to take a break and catch my breath sometimes. But yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed. If you did like the video and subscribe for more. Bye.